Hello, hola, senores y senoritas. I'm meteorologist Jeff Matthews. Welcome to Weathertainment 2.0. I'm going to give you a great forecast here in just a moment. But first things first, don't forget, you can count on three things here every time you check out Weathertainment. Most accurate forecast you can find, an educational component. Can't move my middle finger without moving the other two. And something humorous, and that may have been it right there for this weathercast. And don't forget to check around the other parts of CNY Weathertainment. Always new stuff going on. The pollen allergy is going away in the next couple of weeks. Be replacing it with something new. Same for the event forecast as well. There's local radar. There's local current conditions all throughout central New York that you can't get anywhere else. So if you're interested in the temperature when you first start your day in the morning or in the evening when you're headed out for a walk, you can check it out there. As well as an astronomy page. Much, much more. And follow me because I know where I'm going. Well, follow me on Twitter. CNY Jeff Matthews. The slice of nice continues for the next three and a half days. Enjoy this because they never last forever. And they never come when you really want them. No rain until Saturday night? It's a question mark. May not even rain Saturday night. Sliver of rain coming through. It's going to be a close call. But the only chance for rain is Saturday night. And seven more days until calendar autumn. It is closing in rapidly. Meanwhile, feels like summer. 82, 84, 85, 80. Okay, that's about as high as we get. But that's a warming trend. And then comes the old thermal cliff. It's back because autumn is here. Anytime you get into the cool season, you get the chance for thermal cliffs. You know what? You don't need to be a meteorologist to figure this out. That's the eastern two-thirds of the country. Everything in here is almost entirely clear. Thanks to big bubble of high pressure. Big bubble, no trouble. You know what? I'm going to call him Tony. Tony the Tiger. Because what he's bringing us is great. Don't forget it. My friends out in Wyoming, it's going to be clouding up there the next several days with a chance of storms, especially after today. But for closer to home in central New York and throughout New England, look at that on the infrared. Nothing to see. Nothing to see. Everything is moving through the south, west, north, out to sea. But for us... Huge, clear patch of skies, all because of that big bubble. And that high pressure area is just going to grow with time and slowly ease northeastwards right over our area. And by the time we get to Friday and Saturday, moving off the Connecticut coastline. So all it is in the next three and a half days is sunny days, warming trend, and clear, coolish nights. Have a look at the almanac for today. We topped out yesterday at 77, one-off forecast. It was a little cooler than I thought it would be. Nothing in the rain gauge because of a totally 100% sunny day yesterday. 12.29 on the daylights. We lose two more minutes, and we'll be back with your forecast in just one minute. Union people love weathertainment. We're back. Sunny, warm, and dry. Perfect day, just like yesterday, but even a few degrees warmer at 82 degrees. Tonight, the three seas, clear, calm, cool, 53. Thursday, hey, you missed today, you get another. Two for the price of none. Sunny, warm, dry, 84 degrees. And you know what? It's not just Thursday, it's Friday as well, and it even continues into the first half of Saturday, where it stays sunny out and warm and dry. And if I could get my clicker to click, you could actually see that. There you go. Sunny, just dandy, like cotton candy for Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, even into half of Saturday. Slight chance for a storm or shower Saturday night. Breezy Saturday, but it's a warm wind. Breezy Sunday, but it's a cool wind. High of only 65 with interchangeable sunny and cloudy periods. It's going to be a very transitional day there. It's going to feel like autumn very quick right there. Thermal cliff and then gradually warming up but staying sunny for Monday and Tuesday of next week. That is your seven-day forecast. Make it a great day.